Okay, so let's check our control bucket again. Let's see what the temperature is in it. Um, this is just sitting here in the shade. It's It's been here for an hour, another hour since we last checked. And it looks like it's still about 60 degrees. So let's see, it's 60 here. Let's see if it goes down anymore. Okay, 60 degrees, holding steady. So now you can see the sun's getting behind the clouds a little bit. It smells a little bit like burnt plastic back here. And this outside of the bucket is pretty warm. Feels pretty good. I may have left these gloves a little bit close. This is kind of warm. Let's check real quick here. I'm gonna just turn this off, I guess, for tonight. There's the switch. We're gonna verify that there's no power to this thing. Right here, no power. Okay, then let's open this bucket. Let's see what we have in here. Okay, I don't know if you can see that steam coming off of there. But there's steam coming off the bucket of water, off the element. Looks like you can see the plastic melted here um, around the element, which makes me really glad that I put that piece of uh, metal around there. You can see there's a hole here, so some of the heat has been escaping, and that's, that's actually okay. Let's measure about the first four inches into this water. Look at this. I don't know if you can see that with the camera. There you go. But it's it's hot. I can feel the heat coming off of it. I've got this uh, thermostat down in there. It's not as hot as it was earlier when I opened it, and the thermostat's reflecting that. 125-ish, 124 degrees. So now what I'm going to do is real quickly, I'm going to just... Uh, stir this up real fast and let's see what we got the whole bucket up to. Remember I stirred it earlier? There we go. And we pull the water off the very bottom, mix it in here. And it actually feels pretty good. I could take a bath in some water like that. Well, that's kind of a cool bath. But let's see what we have here now. So we put the whole uh, thermostat in there. I've put my arm down in that water and stirred it around. So this water is 90 degrees. That's after about two hours uh, of sitting here with the solar panel running on it. We're about done generating heat for today. If it was to generate any more heat, it would basically just hold uh, the temperature.